Hello YouTubers, Custom Comments here with another review of the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Justice League Flash. And <clears throat> once again, it is a dope figure, but McFarlane is sort of, he have left out some paint to be desired. And this is going to be a, a uh, I'll say a challenging custom to do because the red, the reds on his suit are different colors. You got a a lighter red, a sort of burgundy red. So I'm trying to figure out what parts to do: darker, lighter. Most definitely needs a gloss up here. So it's going to be a challenge, but I know we can pull it off. Okay, so right now we'll just take a look at uh, how he is now, in which he doesn't look too bad. Just looks, you know, uh, just look too much like plastic, like a plastic toy. If you understand what I'm saying up here, he just needs some paint. He needs some paint, some serious paint. But good looking Flash though. I mean, he do resembles. The actor. You do know the actor's name, Aiden? While my son look up the name, we look at this, his uh, design of his suit. Lots of details in this thing, man. Let's see if that'll clear up. Yeah, lots of design. So that looks very nice. Yeah, suit. It's nice, man. Ezra Miller. Okay. I guess it's Ezra Miller. Okay. If I'm saying that right. If I'm not. Oh, well. But. <clears throat> not a bad looking flash at all. This would be a fun custom. It will be a fun custom. I do like it. Okay, so that's the aesthetics of them. Let's see them back right here. Okay, and we'll go over his accessories, which he comes with the base. Everybody know how the DC base look. Okay, so I'm not gonna show that. And the calling card here. All right, the back. If you want to pause it, read it. You can. Alright. Alright, so he comes with this calling card. He comes with these his running effect pieces. And he has a total of four of those. So we'll look at these. They look real nice. And I'm going to do two segments of this video or review I'm gonna go ahead and go through all the articulation of him like this and then we'll come back and show you the custom okay but yes he has four of these so that's cool alright so now let's go over Flash's articulation alright So Flash can look up a whole lot. He can look down very good now since I did the neck mod. He couldn't look down like that before. He has good tilt. Very good tilt. Okay. Uh, he goes side to side. Arms can go up to the T-pose. Alright. He do a full 360. He has double jointed elbows. That works good. Okay. He has a bicep swivel. Works good. You get an upper torso that's sort of stiff and a waist. So he can bend down pretty good. Alright. And you know in package he comes in that um in the position where he's running. Only thing you have to do in his diaper or whatever, sort of be out of shape. You just warm it up and it'll go back in shape. 
That's all you have to do. Okay. So he has that rotation up in the shoulder, as you see. Okay. The legs can go out that much. Okay. Do we have a thigh swivel? Very little. Very little thigh swivel. Okay. He has double jointed knees. Works good. Okay. A hinge foot. He has hinge feet and a toe hinge. He has ankle rocker. As you see that, good ankle rocker. All right, he can kick up this much. And it goes out to the side. All right, he can go back that much because this is real soft. His diaper, very soft, okay? So he can go back that much, all right? So that's gonna be, he has hinge wrist. Swivel them too, okay? But this is real stiff right here. This, and this is sort of hard. So it'd be hard to do a mod with this cause it's not soft where I can make them bend down more forward. But the waist part goes down pretty good. Pretty good. But yes, he needs some work. I ain't gonna lie, this is the back of them. Okay. All the detailed sculpt work is there. But it's just the lack of paint. And I had one of my uh, YouTube subscribers or watchers ask, um, are we gonna do a custom on the flash? Cause he's, the paint sucks on him. But <clears throat> yes, we most definitely will do a custom paint on him. He needs it bad, but stands pretty good. I like them, and they did make them. Even though the scale, the height is the same as the others, they at least made them slender. They don't make them the same build, so that's good. That's a good thing from a falling. Okay, but not a bad flash. All right. So stay tuned for the custom work. All right. And here we go with the custom. And this damn near took all week cause it's just a total repaint. Don't, don't even look like plastic anymore. I mean, my girlfriend, she painted the whole thing over. The burgundy, everything. And where this was sort of a burgundish black, she just went black. So that way it pops more. So it's a total repaint. Okay. And it's going to take me some time to go through all the details she done. Of course, first thing you see is all the stripes painted silver. And she did the rivets. Okay. And it's, it's not totally consistent with the movie. She did her own thing right here, like painted the gold stripes uh, in here where it was black in the movie. She did gold. Even the gold here, she went back in and put a stripe of burgundy in between the gold. Let me get a little bit closer where you can see this. That'll clear up for me. See that? This is dope, man. Just a total repaint here too. She painted gold and she went in between the lines and painted burgundy. Look at the back of the his helmet. This is remarkable. Like I said, she still surprises me. And I've had a couple of my subscribers really wanted this flash paint, a, a custom paint. And here you go. She killed it, man. What do you think, Aiden? Looks awesome, Dad. The shoes. She redid the shoes. Which this was on the outside of the shoe. Okay. With and it had the the inside wasn't painted. So she painted the inside too. Remarkable man. 
the mold was there but it just wasn't painted okay so as you can see she gave him a black gum bottom painted underneath remarkable this is what I'm talking about man so, the neck area painted all this painted well, that is real. I love how she did the, the back of his helmet. Sick. Just sick. And she redid the, not the uh, flash, the stripe. She did but the gray background. I think it was like a, a off white. I think that looks good. Cause we pulled up some images on uh, online. So, just getting a few ideas, adding to what she already have a remarkable job she's done. But, damn. All here painted black. Yep, this might be her best custom. And she have done some remarkable custom paints on these figures, man. So damn. So all right. So now I guess we can get ready. We'll do some size comparisons, and I most definitely uh, I'm waiting on Superman now. We're most definitely gonna customize that too. Okay. But yes, before we do side purse, the hands, the gloves. I want you to look at the gloves. All the paint in between the gloves. It's remarkable. It's crazy. Okay. Oh, that looks good. All right. And something else I want to point out. Even here, to clear up, my camera is really taking its time. Painted all of this right here. The gold here with the burgundy in the middle of the uh, gold again, a little seam. She put burgundy there. Of course, here again. Like I said before, I just wanted to point it out with this card. My fingers can't tell you everything. Painted all this. So it's just, oh, this, the little specs right here. The, this thing is really has a lot of detail, sculpted detail, not painted. Okay, all this. Just, like I said, she surprises me. All this right here too. Just detail. Okay. So what we'll do, we'll do some comparisons. She also gave him a little, painted the lips a little bit. I think that does look good. Okay, so we'll stand him back right here. We're gonna put up all our customs. Okay, let's do that. Now we will put our custom cyborg, which I've done a review on him some months ago, I guess, and I just added one of the cyborg figures uh put the arm there since i had two of them so i wanted to uh do that i think that looks good let's put this out okay so we see how they stack up that looks good so this is one of the cus our customs just 
just custom by putting him together. Only thing I did was like paint the arm a little bit more silver to go with this face by names project. Okay, this is really the infected Superman. All right, all right, and we will get Aquaman in here. Looking dope. All right. Okay, let's try to get Gorilla Grodd in here. It's gonna be damn near impossible to get all these. I gotta get Bane. <laughs> let's see. Okay, now we're gonna get Bane in here. One that I painted. It's about the only one I painted. <laughs> okay, so Bane. All right, and here is another custom that she painted, Shao Kahn. All right, boy, he just covered Superman. <laughs> but, but that's not one that she painted, so I'm gonna take him out. I was just wanting to show you off the arm. I think that's pretty damn cool. Okay. So Shao Kahn, and I have to get the Wonder Woman. All right, and one more, which is Wonder Woman. And this one is a dope one too. Okay, so let's get her standing here. So yeah. These are all our customs, which I think they all look great. Okay. So I just wanted to share you guys. I know it was some of my subscribers really waiting on this flash. And I think she nailed it. It's just just awesome. Awesome. Cause this thing didn't have no paint on it, Holly. Okay. So flash does look good. Wow. Once again, she still amazes me. Awesome job. All right. So if you guys got any questions or requests, make sure to hit me up in them comments. Or hit me up on Instagram, and I will be sure to get back with you. All right. All right, everyone. This is Custom Comments signing out. Take care. God bless. Be safe. Peace.